Uh, I feel like uh, it'll be a lot different, you know, uh, from meetings being longer and uh, actually putting on pads and um, getting ready for our first preseason game. What's uh, stood out to you about Blake as you get to know him more? Oh, uh, you know, he's just always there to help me out. If I don't know something, just uh, asking me if I need anything, just always being there for me and just helping me out with the plays and stuff. Off season been for you in, in terms of maybe years past compared to now? Is it um, kind of a longer preparation to get ready for this than you're used to? Yeah, like since uh, ever since I got down with football, since we lost our last game against Ohio State, we've been uh, I just been football, you know, working out, training, getting ready for the combine and pro day, and also getting ready for uh, the training camp. So I've just been constantly football every day. Is there a balance somewhere of maybe not doing too much and? and Maybe to not do enough. I mean, how do you figure out that balance? So you um, I just uh, I just talk to my trainer, asking what I need to do. So usually I just just evening out, you know, take some breaks sometimes. But mostly I just been getting in shape and just working out. What have you been doing? Biggest adjustments going to be for you here on the NFL level? Uh, just um, getting used to the speed of the game. You know, it's going to be different. You know, you're going to have a lot more free time now. So you just got to find stuff that you like to do. What do you like to do? Uh, <laughs> uh, I usually like play basketball, watch Netflix, play the video games, just stuff like that. So you were, were you with Blake during his off season time? Did you spend much time with him? No, I was. Uh, I was actually back at home in Daphne working out, so I was just by myself. Back home in Daphne. Yeah. Do you look at yourself as you can be the starter? How do you do that? Huh? Do you look at yourself as, hey, I'm going to be the starter? Oh, uh, no, nah, I mean, we're just out there just competing with each other. It's going to be a competition this year, and uh, we are just going to make each other get better. So, you know, we'll find out um, when come season. Have you been leaning on the veterans in the locker room to kind of get adjusted to the game? Yeah, I talked to uh, Toby and uh, Toby and um, and Storm and Denard and all those guys, and they uh, they helped me out. They tell me things to do, just what, what not to do and stuff to look at. Adjustment if you weren't, because you've been starting in college. Huh? Would it be a, would it be an adjustment if you weren't starting, because you've been used to starting? In college? Uh, I mean, my freshman year I didn't start. I took uh, me and Eddie switched out, so I mean, I'll, I'll be used to it. And we always rotated at Alabama. Have you been able to talk to Eddie and kind of get advice from him as well? Uh, I mean, I have his number, but uh, I hit him up every now and then. But I haven't really, I didn't see him when I was working out or when I went back to Tuscaloosa for a little while. I didn't see him. Did you work out at school? I went up there for uh, a couple of days, but mostly I was just working out back at home. Back home. Well, what city's home? Huh? What city is home? Daphne. TJ, do you find that you, uh, you actually perform better or feel better when you're sharing the load a, a little bit, or at least some of the reps instead of carry, you know, say carry it 25 times a game? Or, I mean, I've, 16 games, season well, special now. Yeah, uh, I mean, at Alabama, I've carried the ball 20, 30 times. I also shared it, but uh, I mean, it's been, I feel like it'll be the same. You know, probably. What do you think of the atmosphere here? Huh? The atmosphere here. Oh, I, I love the atmosphere here, you know. Just, uh, I just got to get used to everything, and uh, hopefully I'll, I will.